So I have a curveball progression that's going to help you develop a nasty 12-6 curveball. So what we do, we're going to get here, feet shoulder width apart, and with your elbow, if there was a dry erase board over here, you're going to try to draw a circle with that elbow, keeping your forearm upright. And you're going to throw and you're going to rip that ball to your belly button. You're going to do this at maybe 20 or 30 feet, but you're going to get a feel for front spinning the ball, getting top spin on the ball. Once you do that, you're going to progress to what I call torso throws. And you're going to get here, come back, and you're throwing with your torso, keeping that vertical forearm creating the top spin. Once you do that, you'll throw a, with a little bit more intensity. And then you'll get back and you'll get your whole body into it. Same feel, getting on top of the ball and throwing it, and then you'll go and do a normal throw after that. The best cue I ever got for a curveball was to show your fingernails to the catcher as you throw. So if you're here and your catcher can't see your fingernails, you're going to throw a side spin ball. But if your catcher can see your fingernails, you're going to have top spin on the ball. So go through that progression, work on getting top spin on your curveball. And uh, let me know if that works, if it helps you out at all.